Does your organisation have a PowerPoint template? And perhaps you'd like to use the theme of that template for other PowerPoint files or maybe across other Microsoft 365 applications. Well, here's how to do it. When you open up your branded template, go to the Design tab. Over to the right hand side, we have a Variants drop down menu and then Colours. So these are all the colours, standard colour themes within PowerPoint. If we click Customise Colours, we'll then see an overview of the six accent colours that you have from your template. We can name this file, click Save, and now that custom colour palette is saved within Microsoft 365. The other option we have is to save the theme. So this will save the colour palette and the fonts. If we go to the drop down menu for the theme, we have a save current theme. And we can do the same thing here, give that a name and click save. If we click on the drop down menu again for themes and we go to our custom theme, we can right click and set as the default theme. Now, when I go to the file tab and new, I can see there's a default theme there. And every time I open up a new presentation, it will pick up that corporate branding with my logo here and my color palette. Let's have a look at how to apply that to another file. So here's a file here with different fonts and different colours. So again, if I go to that variance drop down menu, I can choose my colour palette and we'll see the colours change a little bit there. I can see we've got the, the pink and the orange are changing. If we click on this, it will apply the theme. There's a couple of other options, though. If we right click, we've got apply to all slides or apply to selected slides. So there are some options for you there. The other option is to apply the custom theme and that will also change the fonts. So I can see now we've picked up the fonts and the color palette. If I go back there, you can see the difference. How do we apply this to other Microsoft programs? Let's have a look at Excel. So here's a file with a chart and the chart is using the custom colors in Microsoft. So let's go to the page layout tab. And here we've got our theme and colors. So under the colors there, there's my Empower. And I can hover over that and you can see it's picking up that color palette. We also have the option to pick the default or the PowerPoint theme. Just a word to note on this, you will also be importing the fonts and the font sizes so it may be better to do the colors so I have a blank email here and let's say i wanted to insert a smart art let's pop that one in there and here's my smart art if i go to options again i've got the color drop down menu we might want to not add a theme because again there might be certain branding constraints with font sizes so the, the adding the color palette might be better so I can add my palette there and then my smart art design, I can change my colors and I'm bringing that color palette into Outlook as well. And in particular, this email. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, like my video and any comments will be very much appreciated. And if you're looking for training for your organization, please reach out. Thanks very much. Bye.